Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in CNSG land. We appreciate your time. My name is Dante White. I am a channel manager here at Ring Central, and I specifically support CNSG and all the agents that work through them. Also joining me here today is the incomparable Derek Ressler. Derek, <laughs> say hello to folks. Hello, everyone. It's great to be here with you guys. I know I've had an opportunity to meet one or two or three of you guys at our various partners academy. So if I've met you before, great to see you again, or at least talk to you again. If I've never met you, well, hopefully one day I will. And as a reminder, everybody is muted, but please ask questions in the Q&A portion or the chat portion. We'll be taking a few breaks here and there to answer any of those questions as we go along in this presentation, and, and I'll definitely be mindful to keep this as short as possible, but to have the most amount of content for you folks so we can get back out there and start doing what you do best and making money. So, A brief agenda, we've got the uh, go over product in the program, positioning and pricing, and then position uh, perpetual revenue of selling Ring Central. So first things first, you gotta know what you're selling and also understand how it's gonna benefit you as a partner here through CNSG's model. So Derek, talk a little bit about how the cloud is one, please. So when we're talking about you know, the product, talking about the program, one of the things we always like to talk about is, is this a product and program that people are actually wanting to buy? Are your customers actually willing to spend money in this area? We want to make sure that you guys are always stay up to date on what the industry is saying. And so we're going to talk about that a little bit right now. And of course, in many of you have probably seen it yourself, if you've been a long time on-premise uh, seller, that's been a tougher and tougher market to get wins in. Margins are shrinking, opportunities are getting smaller, and more and more customers are talking about the cloud. They've got a variety of things in the cloud. Maybe they run their exchange in the cloud or have Office 365 or they use Dropbox or Fox or any of those type solutions. They're all in the cloud and they want to know what else can they run the cloud. So there's a lot of advantages for customers. We, also, we always want to keep them front of mind. And so what this one talks about is that Synergy has seen in the last year a negative 9% growth rate, I believe, uh, in this last quarter actually was up to a negative 11% for the quarter. So it's only increasing in the amount of people who are looking to transition to the cloud. This is your standard on-premise. So if you're looking to you know, think about your Avaya Auras, your Avaya um, you know, uh, office products, IP office products, that's kind of your on-premise you see. And of course, any Cisco H HSC or HCS and things like that. Cloud is actually growing at about a 22% rate. Ring Central's almost double that. So when it comes to who's actually the main players within that cloud space, Ring Central's actually being the best when it comes to growth. And so as we like to say here, the cloud is one, and Ring Central is winning that cloud. So thank you to be on this call with us to learn about how Ring Central can really help you as a partner drive revenue. Uh, so this little bit of the platform, I'll let Dante share a little bit about kind of the big platform, and that's the biggest reason why we've had the success that we've had. Sure. So to go back to the, the point of this particular junction in the presentation is to understand the product itself. A lot of um, you have been selling UCAS for a while or VoIP, and that's kind of a bad word around here because what we have here <laughs> is, is a true UCAS provider, and it is a true platform. So when you look at this holistic approach that we've taken to the market, it's important to understand how we differentiate, and this is going to come up in your opportunities, because the way that our product works and the way that you present it, it is a little bit more expensive than some of the other providers that might be in your repertoire. It might be a little bit more expensive than someone that you might be competing against from a different partner's perspective. So it's important to understand and position it correctly. Uh, first and foremost, we are open and integrated. So if you go to developers.ringcentral.com, we have over 130 public integrations. We also have hundreds of private integrations that people have built in-house. Um, you, as well as I know, that that is going to become the important part about selling UCAS because businesses need to become more agile, they need to become more automated, and they need to be able to react and participate in markets. 
Um, we do offer global office too, and this is a true global presence. So when presenting this to clients that do have a global footprint, we have DIDs all over the globe. And some of those can be actual presence, some of those can be virtual numbers. Reach out to me if you have an opportunity like that so we can talk about the finer points of how to position that portion of it. Team collaboration is another thing that I really push hard with what our platform has because it's something that a lot of our competitors don't offer on their platforms. And what that is is Glip. Um, go to glip.com. It is a freemium model, so you as a partner, even if you're not on Ring Central Solution and your customers can also do this too, they can download Glip. Um, and it's like a hip chat or a Slack. Once you're a true Ring Central customer, it opens up the gate to a lot of other cool features and the integration in the phone system itself, you know, seeing voicemails there, doing some project management tools for dispersed work teams. Uh, contact center is another large portion of what we do and much like Ring Central being a leader in its space, our contact solution also is a leader in its space. It's actually just getting off a, a phone call right before this with the ACNSG deal where we were talking about contact center and the types of things that customers need. So be aware that is part of it. Uh, CNSG offers in contact as their contact center solution and that's what Ring Central's contact center solution is too. The beautiful thing about selling it through Ring Central is it is one bill and it is once again part of this whole architecture of the holistic approach so it makes it easier to sell it in one bundle it makes it easier for the customers to make that decision um, we'll talk about contracts and how those work later on for customers and how much of a headache that can be in the normal space and how we alleviate those pains conferencing is something native to the solution as well audio bridge lines unlimited calling texting and faxing from any user on our space which is huge. Texting is a big part of what the, uh, the makeup of the business world is becoming now. And then the last two are video meetings like we're on here today that's native to the solution and native to every seat. And then the last part is analytics. That is offered on our Cloud PBX platform. It's obviously offered on the contact center solution. And we have a real-time analytics platform that you can add to the PBX as well. So we'll talk about ways to optimize your revenue when selling it that way as well. One of the things I always like to to add um, in this, when we talk about platform, just saw a, a note today that said that 25 year olds and younger, about 60 to 70 percent of them prefer to communicate digitally now. And if that's the case, what is that? What's the implication for business? What's the implication for your customers when they have people trying to reach them and everything else? Having a communication system and a collaboration system like Ring Central is a significant value add because now they're able to do the way, uh, communicate in the way that their customers and even their employees prefer to communicate. So it really allows them the chance if they just don't want to do hard hard you know desk phones that's fine they can do mobile phones they can do soft phones they can do texting and all that type of stuff it's all built in it's like what dante said we are not a VoIP play all right so if they're looking just for phone we can do that but that's a small part of the whole puzzle of what we have here to offer and i think that goes really into this next slide dante and that is taking the whole platform and translating it into well what does this mean for me when I'm out there selling? How can I talk about the platform in such a way that gives me the best chance to sell? So using this slide, how do you help and present this? Sure, so as I mentioned earlier, we are a little bit more expensive if you're looking at competitors like Vonage or, or a Mitel or a play like that, right? So when discussing potential opportunities with your clients, you really wanna understand everything that they're doing communication. Are they doing web conferencing? Is it something that they might be doing in the future? You can even start selling this to opportunities where they're not using it or they haven't thought about using it. I used to do a lot of government sales. And what we did with the Ring Central Meetings platform is we turned it into a way for parents to do parent-teacher conferences that weren't able to come into the marketplace. So then you're adding value for your customers, right, by setting up a mold and a model that's going to work for them. So understand, are they using conferencing? Is it something that they're going to need? Um, understanding are they using internal communication tools like Link or Google Hangouts. Understand what their PBX or their cloud offering that they're already on for just their voice is and what that means for their business. And then also looking at other uh, tangibles too like Box, uh, something like 
Office 365, Google, several of the integrations and start building that value up front because you're not going to see that in a lot of providers. Some of them, yes, do offer similar things, but a lot of them don't offer it. So for the clients like this one here, this is a, uh, this is box, right? This is so box. what they've done is instead of it looking at it from being expensive, it actually enabled them to uh, drive nearly $1 million annually in savings because we minimized and took over redundant technologies and we made it easier for them to have one bill, right? So they don't have multiple contracts that are gonna auto renew all over the place. Yeah, so when you're thinking about that, you know, put on your sales hat and think about customers. What's frustrating to the customers? One of the main frustrating things to a customer is unpredictive costs that they have to bear on a monthly basis, quarterly basis, annual basis. A lot of that cost is done because they've got all these random cloud tools that they're paying a significant amount of money for that have their own maintenance agreements, their own 1-800 numbers for tech support, their own auto renewal dates, and their own SLA, and all these things they have no idea, especially if you get into the 40 employee, 50 employee and above space, they have no idea what the cost truly is until they run an audit and an annual audit to see where they went overages and all the type things that go into it. So in this example for Box, right out of the gate, consolidation was a million dollar savings. Right out of the gate, because they could centralize all communications on one platform that did everything that all these other ones do, the Skypes, the Live Ops, the Google Hangouts, the Go Assists, the Intercalls. So if you look at it, they've got three different video platforms of Link, Skype, and Hangouts. They've got multiple audio conferencing things with short tail talk desk and intercall and uber conference i mean all these things and it's typical this is very mm -hmm. very typical of uh, your customers and right now your customers are bearing this burden and they don't even know it they have no idea how much money they just look at their bottom line at the end of the year and go wow how come our costs are so high but they don't think about these little teeny pieces that all add up box did start thinking about it when they thought about it it was a no-brainer to move over to a UCAS solution, especially one like Ring Central that has every single platform feature that they need to be successful. And again, that's the power of the platform. So the one part was the platform. Let's talk about the program, Dante. What does the program of Ring Central do for our CNSG listeners? What can we do for them? Well, it's quite simple. I mean, there's a picture of a rocket. You're going to blast off and you're going to make a lot of money doing this. And the reason why that is, is we have something called channel harmony here at Ring Central, from one customer up to infinity. And what we've done is we've taken subject matter experts, maybe they're vertically focused, they do nothing but healthcare, maybe they're geographically focused, uh, maybe they're company size oriented because we do segment by company size as well. And what we've done is we've given you an additional sales force. So whether you're a partner with one person or you're a partner with 100 sales employees, you've just contracted about 1,000 more, right? And you don't have to pay these folks. There's no 1099, there's no benefits. For you as a partner, by leveraging this, you get 100% of the sales commissions too. You're really good at what you do, building relationships in the marketplace. You're really good at your managed services. You're really great at connecting those dots for your clients, and maybe your strong suit isn't UCAS, maybe it's not telecom, maybe you don't even know how to have those conversations. And we do, we live it every single day, so we bring this to the table for you. And we'll talk about later what each one of those pieces are. The important thing is you are making 100% commissions on these, and you don't have to become a leading central expert. You just know have to know how to identify someone that would be a potential Green central client. Yeah, and I think for this, when I'm out talking to partners at academies, and I know, Dante, when you're talking to partners um, on the phone or through RC meetings, the ones that you get a chance to shake hands with, a lot of the times they hear this channel harmony, but they really don't believe it because their experience at other vendors who say very similar stuff has not been the case. And I like to say this, and what I always say is, look, in that 49 and below space, which is normally where our other competitors start to fail in because they really don't offer that space, those resources in those smaller type opportunities. We have dedicated headcount internally here at Ring Central who all they do is work with partners to sell that one to 49 digital line and employee count space. That's all they do, which means they're dedicated to understanding channel, 
understanding your business, understanding how you sell, understanding the implications, or if things don't go well, what the implications are to you as a partner. So they really understand working with channel uh, partners. Most, if not all, of our uh, competitors, they struggle to do that because they're all out there in that smaller space making their own phone calls, trying to make their own money, not at Rank Central. It is dedicated to you. So you're going to truly work with someone who really wants to understand business and how to sell. And what I always like to say, it's 100% commission for you. Obviously, it's 100% commission for them, so there's no competition. But it's also 100% control. We really want you as the partner to tell us how you want us to engage with your with your customer. Mm -hmm. If you want to run the whole thing, you run the whole thing great. Our dedicated 1 to 49 has got hundreds of opportunities they can be working on. So if you just want to leverage them for resources, great. Let us know that. However, if you want to go the opposite route, hey, I really this is someone maybe I met at the line at Subway or at the at you know my neighbor. I really don't know their business. I really don't have time to go after it and really chase it down. Why don't you guys do it for me? Great. You're going to get 100% commission on all of those sales both and we'll talk about it here at the end today as well as in the future yep. and that's the beauty of channel harmony is it channel perfection no things come up that's why you have dante white reach out to dante white if the experience that you're having isn't what you're you really were hoping it to be and dante white can help provide you that resource to kind of get things done here on our end that you might think aren't as they should be so want to really help you understand how to leverage Dante best as well as how to really leverage like Dante said this massive sales force that is waiting to close deals and that kind of goes to the second thing I love talking about when it comes to our process here with our program you register the lead all right you let your channel manager Dante White know hey look I put a lead in there Dante so I want to help you just to make sure that you get me with the right person all right that starts all of the automation within our sales force gets you to the right segment, the right territory, and the right you know subject matter expert. And then you guys get on a call together. You guys talk about that opportunity. You tell us how you want us to engage. And we're gonna abide by the rules of engagement that you set. And what is this equal to you or the three biggest things you care about most in the sales life? Short sales cycles, increased close rates, and increased revenue. Absolutely. And I'll say this, that the numbers bear it out. Those who leverage our subject matter expert program, our close rates around 39%. For those who choose not to, it's 3%. Those are huge numbers. So if you want to maximize your time, maximize your potential for close rates and huge revenue gains, really leverage our subject matter expert program. And if you're out there and you're like, yeah, this has been a really great experience. I've done it a lot. Fantastic. If you're new, you're a little unsure, this truly does happen. Grab more time with Dante. Go dive into the process a little bit more just to really help you to get a little bit tighter when it comes to what we can be doing for you. And then lastly, resources. You know, a lot of times people say we've got tons of resources, but they don't ever really tell you what the heck that is. All right, so yeah, we've talked about the subject matter experts. We've talked about, you know, their success engineers that help you run the demos, anything technical, even do POCs for your, for your customers. All right. Um, our subject matter experts handle all quotes and discounting. So if you want to know from a programmatic spec, who do I go to to get a quote? Don't go to Dante. All right. Go to your subject matter expert. They can do all the discounting. They've got the authority to do all that. and They've got all the ability to do that. Where can Dante really help you out as a, comp as, as a group? You want to learn about our pro service? You want to learn about our implementation process? You want to learn about our customer success managers, our security? our compliance, everything from Glyph down to our product experts on every single feature, that's Dante for you. He can get all that and get you really equipped and trained up so you can feel more confident about the program. Anything opportunity, work it with your subject matter expert. They have access to all the resources you need to close that particular deal. Um, you want to give a good example, really, Dante, of resources sure. and how it can really, really help. No, absolutely. So recently we've won two rather large deals with CNSG Group, and what we were able to leverage is not only the sales expertise of the Ring Central subject matter expert and what they brought to the table from an engineering side on the front end, was the most important part was using the pro service element. So these were rather large deployments, 
multiple job sites. They had integrations as well. They also had, uh, one of them had a global portion of what they did. And to be able to implement that and push that through can be very cumbersome, not only for you as a partner, but it can also be very, uh, it can cause a lot of anxiety for these customers that are going to be making switches. With our pro services element, we were able to leverage that in the marketplace and help them have a, str a strong, seamless transition into their new system. You know, because that's the number one complaint from most people that switch over to a new carrier is, well, they left us kind of holding the bag and we didn't know what to do. With our pro services element, we map out your success from the very beginning by understanding how they want this to roll out. Do they want it done in one fell swoop? Are they gonna be doing multiple sites throughout you know, a six month time frame? However that is, we're gonna map that success for you and we're gonna make sure that we reach those goals together in unison. All right, I think, I mean, we're gonna talk a little bit about a great win that CNSG had a little bit later. We can dive more into some of those pro service things. There's a lot of resources, and I think what I love most is that Rink Central actually does it in our own dime. These are resources that you don't have to pay for, resources your customer doesn't have to pay for. This is all stuff. So when it comes, when we talk about partnership, normally from a vendor that means you do, and I'm going to call you just on whenever you get deals done or your pipeline. That's not a partnership, all right? What we have at Ring Central is a true partnership because we put substantial skin in the game in terms of resources, time, commitment to you. And so we will dedicate these resources and the time and we'll fly out and we'll spend that money on our own end. All right. It is a true partnership that we have with you. Um, so let's stop right now. If there's any questions, definitely use that Q&A field up there because it really helps us to organize, make sure we don't miss any questions. Uh, but if you do have any questions, definitely feel free to ask. Um, if not, and it looks like at the moment you guys are so blown away that you don't even have anything to ask yet. So why don't we go into positioning and pricing? We're just that good. We are good. <laughs> we get into positioning and pricing, so I know this is going to generate some some interaction. So positioning, Dante. Absolutely. So position us. Let us get in it. So this is a slide that I like to showcase for not only partners but also for end customers. Um, you know, to alleviate that anxiety, it's important to know who they're dealing with. That's going to be the backbone and the fundamental of what they're doing as an organization. If the phone's not ringing, there's not dollars in the door, so it can be very arduous to go through this. Ring Central, as a whole, has over 350,000 customers, and that's individual customers, not you know one uh, line, right? So it's from a one-user space, mom and pop shop, to some of the largest global organizations across the planet that have 10,000 users in you know 30 countries. Uh, we have a 98% retention rate, 98.7% uh, retention rate here at Ring Central, um, and a lot of that has to do with our employees here and the way that we do envelop and we wrap around the uh, the partner space, right? So 67% of us are customer facing. It might be someone like myself. It might be our subject matter experts. It might be an engineer. It might be our 24/7 follow the sun support. Uh, some of that support is U.S. based. A lot of that support is U.S. based, especially in the larger space too. So it's important to understand what that looks like too. We have 12 years of innovation in this space and we own our platform. We're not white labeling something else. So it's um, important to understand that too. Uh, we invest a ton of money in our platform and it shows and it seeks volumes because we are the UCAS leader, right? You're going to see that down at the bottom. We're the Garden Magic Quadrant leader. We win all kinds of other great accolades and awards. And every eight to 10 weeks, your customers are going to get a new deployment of Ring Central, whether that's user interface, whether that's new features. And it's great for them because they're, as their businesses grow um, and as the marketplace dictates what we're doing, we are investing in that because we're at the forefront. We're, uh, we're stock exchange on the NYSE. RNG is our ticker. Check out, take a look at what our stocks are doing versus competitors, right? For some of you, that might mean something. For your customers, some of them might not need anything. But what it means for me and the way I articulate it is, is it gives you a level of transparency of the company that you're dealing with. You can see who our executive board is. You can see where our company goals are. You can see where we're headed in the marketplace, right? And then you can also see what we're doing versus competitors because it's important to invest in a company that is gonna be in it for the long haul. 
We mentioned earlier that global coverage is a big key of what we're doing here at Ring Central. We have over 80 countries where we have presence, and if you have some clients that do business internationally or they have international locations, reach out to me and we can talk about the differences uh, between global office and our international virtual numbers, because there's two different things and two different ways that we can approach that in the market. Uh, obviously, we mentioned that Gartner is a big way that these upmarket opportunities are coming into Ring Central. They're looking at the leaders, and we are there. And then lastly, and this is something that's near and dear to my heart, I host a lot of talks on these, called Dante's Information Download, is the API integration of what we're doing. So your businesses that you're dealing with are looking for advanced ways to, to do business, to automate tasks, to make things sync together, to be more intuitive, and to really run their businesses as a streamlined communication platform. And that's what the APIs are doing for customers, day in and day out. It is, and, and I think with that integration, more that's gonna become more and more of a bigger issue as uh, smaller and smaller organizations, companies who are leveraging the cloud to do their business, um, a significant portion of their data, significant portion of their CRM type work is all in the cloud because they've never been able to afford anything on premise. So anything that they bring in from a communication and collaboration standpoint will need to be able to integrate with their current business applications. Mm -hmm. Ring Central has a fully exposed, and I say fully, I really mean fully. Other of our competitors, they're exposed, but it's not fully exposed. They hold things back. We are fully exposed, open API developers.ringcentral.com, go in there, and you can obviously you can even start right now yeah. writing code against anything that you think that you could sell. We even put your app up in our app store for people to actually buy. You can get generation generate revenue there. One of the things I'd like to point out before we move on is that 98.7 retention rate. Talking to some of our, our newer hires here in the channel management team who've come from some of our competitors, they've in, in the old telco space, anything over 95% was considered huge, pop the cork. You know, we're having a huge year because our we only have 5% debook rate. Ring Central is almost 99%. And when you talk about channel partner clients, our channel partner clients are over 99%. So what does that mean for you? Why is that important? The importance is you're bringing solutions that they love. Your customers are gonna love having a solution, they're gonna keep it within their organization, and that's gonna allow you to sell more products and services around it. So we have many partners who use Ring Central as that beachhead, as that hook to get in, and then they are able to sell the whole rest of their, plat or their portfolio and make a significant amount of money doing so, all right? And so we wanna keep that on the forefront. When you are bringing Ring Central to your customers, you're bringing something that they're not going to get rid of, they're going to really enjoy, it's going to increase your brand equity within that customer, help you to expand your service and your portfolio, and again, generate more revenue. What we always say, Ring Central was a good revenue driver, but it should be a multiplier for you and your company, because you should be selling all your other services in there. So definitely leverage us as that. They're not going to debook, they're going to love what they have. And that's why I really love the story. I love kind of saying, you know, reflecting on Gartner, Frost and Sullivan, IHS, just Aragon, because basically any vendor can tell you exactly what I just said and paint the greatest picture. But when it comes to what third-party validators say that aren't in a pay-to-play, you know, these are third-party tech evaluators who go out there that make the recommendations. They have very difficult criteria, and they will drop people off. So on this chart, you won't see bondage. All right, Vonage has been on the Gartner Magic Quadrant for the last few years, not on anymore. Well, why is that? And they tell you, well, their global footprint, their ability to go up market into larger and larger opportunities isn't set up there yet to be successful. Well, okay, well, why is Ring Central successful? Well, we're continuing, like Dante said, dumping money back in to become still the leading in innovation. We're still the only UCAS provider that has a webinar service that has a team collaboration service as a part of it. You can go on down the road of the various feature sets that we have. But what we love to say most is we've continued to move up. And what does moving up mean on the Magic Quadrant? It means that we're able to actually implement. We've got the global deployment set up and ready to go to actually service our customers who have international locations. It means that we've got our support structure set up so that when it comes to first call tech and second call support and third and fourth, we're set up to manage and handle a global footprint 
as well as being able to deal with those who are here in the United States and everything else with world-class recognized service and support. And so that's why we continue to move up and we've actually passed carriers now. We've passed AT&T, we've passed BT and their ability to execute on what they're selling. So Ring Central is gonna to continue to grow and to move upward largely because of our partners. So thank you very much for all the hard work you guys do and the implementations that you build, that you build out to your customers and provide. But just rest assured, we're constantly improving our support, constantly improving our global footprint and how we can deploy for you guys. And of course, a whole bunch of the other ones, Frost and Solve and IHS, uh, Forbes is not on here. Forbes has us listed as one of their top 100 trusted companies. So if you're talking to a customer who's got a lot of security questions, we're on Forbes Top 100 Trusted. That's purely a well-vetted security um, list to be on. We passed that and we're on that list. Definitely reach out to us if you have any security questions as well. Dante can get you in contact with the right people. But that's why we love the Gartner Magister Quadrant. A little bit about the actual UCAS market itself and kind of reflecting on what's been the main, main moves within the UCAS space. Dante, you kind of want to share what this would mean to them. Absolutely. So I shared this this morning on LinkedIn for the CNSG partners joining this webinar because I think it's important to understand what this really means. It is you know, obviously a third party validation. So you can look at every player that's important in the market space today from the UCAS space. Obviously, we've got the growth, right? We're at the top. Uh, you can see some of our competitors much lower. But more importantly, look at the trend of that line and how that is accelerating. You know, it is constantly going up. Like I said, that rocket ship. We are shooting off, and we're happy to have you aboard and come with this. We have the highest subscriber seats among the UCAS vendors, um, and we're growing at, what, 137% faster than the other competitors? That is, in that yeah. is insane. And with that channel harmony program built into it, you know, you can come along for that ride and make this very easy on yourself. Obviously, I'm not going to read the numbers, but you can see that right there on the side. And as we talked about earlier, that on-premise portion of the marketplace is going away. Uh, if you've sold or if you've seen anything in the news, right? Avaya, they're out of the game. Toshiba's dismantled their PBX environment. And then also now you start seeing mergers and acquisitions starting to happen in the marketplace because competitors couldn't meet what they wanted to, like the Mitel and the Showtel mergers of the world. So it's important to uh, to understand that you Ring Central was born in the cloud, yeah, right? So we've been doing this and only this, not something as an afterthought, and that's why you're seeing this acceleration. Yeah, and it's a, I mean to put this in dollars and cents for you guys. So roughly, if you narrowly define UCAS as those purely uh, proprietary uh, solutions in the cloud, all right, that's roughly um, in gross sales expected to be about two billion dollars this year um, in uh, the U.S. All right, Ring Central has a 20% market share, and we're growing at about 11%, um, as well as the market itself is growing. So we're only going to expect to continue to gain market share through 2018. So when you're talking about bringing products to your customers, to be able to say I have the market leader and market share leader, that's a huge deal when it comes to your customers trusting you to provide them with what they think is the best solution for them and their company. So you're talking about a massive growth. Look at here, the only other person that's actually growing a tad is Fuse, and they're, they really only play in your Fortune 1000 space. But their market's, what, 4%? Every other competitor is basically, and this is the biggest thing, in an industry that is growing, their market share is shrinking. That should tell you a lot about their ability to perform for you. Ring Central is exponentially growing, like Dante said, so that should communicate to you, they could do a lot for me. They've got the right program, they've got the right product, now it's up to me just to introduce them to my customers and we can start making a lot of money together. All right, so in terms of you know some logos, we've got gobs of logos, and I see a question came in, we'll definitely answer that at the next question period um, or two. Mm -hmm. um, tell me a little bit about kind of the logos and kind of where are we at? Sure. So. Ring Central plays with every business, right? Everyone's got to talk on the phone, and everybody's going to the cloud. So these are just a couple of places where we play a little bit stronger than others. Technology companies, obviously, they get it. 
they know what Ring Central brings to the table, so they want some of the best. So that's where you start seeing the boxes, the octas of the world. Uh, automotive industry is a huge portion of what we do as well. Lift, Toyo tires, dealer socket, just a couple of those big names because they understand the mobility aspect and also the integration aspect, which is important for dealerships, uh, as is contact centers, right? Those, uh, those internet sales managers, which I accidentally wanted to look at a car yesterday and now they're calling me incessantly. That is part of what Ring Central does, right? Gives them the ability to do that. Uh, real estate is huge for us. The mobility aspect to be able to move and change people as people lose the leave the organization, to change those phone numbers over to new agents, to be able to spin up a Ring Central meeting and showcase a home for someone that might not be able to come up. Uh, that's huge for me. And so is the construction vertical too because of that. You know, you see DICOM industries with multiple job sites and, and sites that pop up out of nowhere. So they need the ability to spin something up. They don't have the time to lay out a network. They don't have the time to spin up a new PBX and buy stuff and have things shipped out. We could do this at the drop of a dime. Um, and then two more industries that we play well into, right, is education, which when I came from the direct side, I deal, dealt in the sled space, right, state and local government education. We play very well in there. Got a couple of big name colleges that we've worked with. We've worked with some municipalities as well. And then healthcare. We have a HIPAA compliant phone system. We have a HIPAA compliant GLIP system. Everything that we do is secure in the way that they need to do business. And they are very, very much so becoming a huge part of what this marketplace is driving. Uh, and this next slide that I'll showcase is, is a real life CNSG win that we did. Uh, it was over. 741 users when we initially rolled it out and as I checked yesterday I think they were up to about 850 uh, and this just took place last year right so large East Coast mental health hospital um, they had several locations and the competition was as you saw in my gardener's quadrant 8x8 eight eight fuse and the incumbent was Cisco the the key aspect of what won this deal was the pro service and Ring Central's professionalism of what we brought to the table. So even prior to winning the opportunity, we had folks on site, we had engineers on site, we had our subject matter experts on site, we're walking the sites with the client because as part of that transition is that anxiety factor. How is this gonna work? How are we gonna get all of the, I think they had 60 locations. How are we gonna get all 60 locations up and running? Um, you know, and we, and we answered that call. We brought the people out and we showed them exactly how that was going to roll. Network assessments, talked about the rollout plan, talked about the integrations, how people were going to get their new phones, how that was going to work. And at the end of the day, that is what won us that deal. And I just love that story. The fact that, you know, some of the other competitors in this space were unwilling to dedicate the resources necessary for CNSG, in this case, to win this deal. So they asked the others, the A-Base, the Fuses, hey, can you come out with your Pro Serve team, walk some of the facilities, you know, give us an idea of a, how to create a project management kind of score sheet for this so that when we when it's ready to go, it's already in place, ready to rock. And we were the only group that said, yes, we will do this. We'll go out, we'll do the plan, we'll put it together. That way, the CNSG partner is like, look, I don't have to write it myself. I'm not an expert on this technology. I'm not an expert on how this is going to impact our network and everything else. Ring Central is. We were going able to go out there and do all of that for them. And the fact that we would go out and win was huge. Because guess what? If I remember correctly, Dante, correct me if I'm wrong. South Shore is like, look, you guys are not the least expensive. No, we don't. I but don't I will pay the extra because I know it's going to work. And it's going to work well. You guys are professional. You guys have a ready to go plan. And it's going to be a great experience for us. So someone making a decision like this, I mean, their job's almost on the line if this starts going south. So they really need to trust that the vendor is going to be able to come through and pull through for them. In this case, for CNSG, they love the fact that we're able to do that, instill that trust, that confidence. And the best part about it, we protected a heck of a lot of margin because we didn't have to discount too much against our competitors to win. We let our, our platform and our professionalism build margin back in for this, this CNSG partner so they can maximize their revenue. And that's why I love this this story because I remember that's what the guy yeah. the client the client said. Basic I'll, I'll I'll pay more so that you guys we get the right thing in here. And the fact that they did that, we kept margin for you guys. I love that story. 
I love it too. You know, I help my partner realize some dreams with those, right? Yeah. And get some uh, some extra dollars in the door. So let's talk about that pricing because it keeps coming up. So we do our pricing, and this is all transparent. It's on RingCentral.com's website. So customers aren't going to get a better deal by going to RingCentral Direct because as an agent, you get the same pricing. We do it on a sliding scale. So you can see as the user count goes up, the price goes down, and so does the way that they purchase. So if they want to do month to month, we have that option. If they want to do a contract paying monthly, we have that option. If they want to do an annual prepay, if they have the capital to do so and pay up front, they get even deeper discounts to do that. We've got those three packages, standard, premium, or enterprise. There's more details that I can go into on that. Uh, if you want to reach out to me or if you just want to go to ringcentral.com, you can see the differentiators between those tiers. Um, and, you know, during our, our pre-sales huddles with the subject matter expert, we'll go over that. We'll go over that fit and what that's going to look like. And then you can expand as needed. You can see down at the bottom, there's a couple of different options that you can add to these packages. Um, everything is native to the solution. We don't have any a la carte options other than, you know, 1-800-MINUTE bundles uh, if people are using 1-800-MINUTES. And then the other one on the next slide is the live reports. So the opportunity that I just left to come uh, host this webinar with a CNSG partner out there was a live reports add-on. So they were looking at Ring Central Office, a rather large call center environment, and live reports was going to be what they were looking at because they needed to see on demand who was calling in, when they were calling in, who's missing calls, who's active. They need to record, they need to whisper in bars, they needed coaching opportunities, you know, they needed that really granular difference. And it adds value to your customers and it adds dollars into your pockets by doing this. Now, as I was leaving that call to come here, I actually uncovered that it was going to be a contact center deal. So contact center deals are where the real dollars are. And if you have anybody that you have in mind, reach out to me because this is great in two ways, right? Um, one, it's the best. They're a winner of Gartner's Magic Project as well as us. Then two, you're going to optimize your uh, your revenue and your effectiveness. It's in contact is the contact center platform which CNSG carries as a as a contact center solution. But the good thing about doing it through Ring Central is now it's one contract, it's one carrier, it's one person to pick up the phone and make sure things are going well, right? So it alleviates some of that stress and that anxiety. And for you as partners, you can start off selling our Ring Central office. You can add a live report to it. And then you can find out later that they go into contact center, right? So you can continue to maximize your revenues. We'll talk about that and at the end of this call on how we're going to do that for you too, because we're identifying these alongside of you. It, it is a true partnership. We are going to walk hand in hand. And, and it's not uncommon for our uh, customers that are looking at getting a Ring Central contact center to add the Ring Central office. And the reason is obviously, as you guys well know, selling in contact yourself, you have to layer that on top of some sort of system out there. Mm -hmm. And that creates potentially a lot of issues because there's going to be issues regarding software, what can be called through, what can be transferred through, what can't. And there's a lot of difficulties because they basically become two separate communication platforms within an organization that require two separate teams to manage. With Ring Central Contact Center, with Ring Central Office, one team has exposure into both environments, both environments interoperate natively, and they can work well together in terms of transferring stuff between, I mean, you can use Glyph as an application between both your contact center and in your office, so everything works seamlessly together as one communication platform. Again, versus having the layer and in contact on top of some other platform that they might have to upgrade for it to even to work. Yeah. With with some other in issues, contact, right? there's a whole host of other issues. Those don't pop up with Ring Central Contact Center with Ring Central Office because it natively works well together, nice and baked. So again, like Dante said, you really want to turbocharge your your margins, your profit. Really start looking in contact center because it's not just about the big farms, the hundred. 250, you know, 300 person contact centers, any customer that has a large inbound call volume needs some sort of way to manage that and to get efficiencies built into that so they can staff it appropriately. Contact center is a great opportunity for them. So, hey, if they just need five seats, great. That's a great upsell for you, for your customer, and you can make a lot of margin. If they need 10, they need three, great. We can do all of that for you 
with Ring Central Contact Center and give your customer a lot of business intelligence to run their business. Um, so a few things here, then we will get to the questions that have been asked. Spence, bundles, how can they make a lot more money with Ring Central, Dante? Why don't well, you tell them? One, you will make a bundle by just partnering with CNSG and myself. Anyways, I am one of those hipsters that does have a man bun, so this particular script <laughs> speaks to me very dearly. Uh, anything that's sub 50 seats, you're going to get a 1x commission bump up front. And anything that's above 50 seats, you're going to get two times that commission uh, up front. Plus, you're going to continue to make those revenues, right? So it's a great way to stack some money here. Um, we've got a big deal for $100,000 extra payout if you sell 10,000 users. Now, it is very possible by doing the Channel Harmony program, right? Because we have people that deal specifically in each one of those spaces, in each one of those verticals to help you in win, win deals like this. Stack that cash and you can make over, uh, or oh, not over, half a million dollars. Right, right at half a million. <laughs> right at half a million dollars. I'm sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself because I'm yes. really excited about this next one. Yes. Uh, I talk about it all the time, the unicorn deal. So you're gonna get a $250,000 bonus payout. You stack that up, with the two times MRR, you're gonna make a million dollars up front. Hashtag the deal is real. Check that out on LinkedIn. We've got a lot of information on it. Reach out to me as well to see what that means. Uh, we're, we're putting our money where our mouth is. You sell one of those large clients, you're gonna make a million dollars up front plus the residuals. It's a no brainer. Here's a lot of cool uh, extra steps we're doing, Derek, right? So mm -hmm. if you're making a million dollars, you gotta ride in style. Might as well do <laughs> so in a Maserati. So for every 750 MRR that you sell as a partner, and it doesn't have to be one deal. This is the important part. So if you sell 10, 75 MRR deals, it stacks up to get you a ticket in this raffle, right? So prizes right there, a Maserati, $60,000 bonus cash, or a $35,000 Rolex. So that's what I really like about this, because at times some of the partners are like, look, Dante, that million dollar at 25000 that's way outside of what I could ever do. So the spiffs really struggled to hit with me. Well, this, you can actually do that, get those 10 deals of 75 MRR in a given quarter and get your ticket in there. And you can even one, you can win a $90,000 car, $60,000 in cash. All right. So anyone can actually win any of these things. It all depends, obviously, how many tickets you have and how lucky you are. But at least it's there. It's available. We're trying to go out of our way to kind of think outside the box with the, the, the normal vendor box when it comes to SPIFs to make sure that you guys are properly incentivized for all the hard work that you guys do. Um, so a few questions here to take. Uh, well, there was a question. There was a question, but it looks like they might have gone away. So someone might have deleted those questions. If you had a question um, and you still want to do it, can you throw it into the chat box? Um, the Q&A um, is up, but uh, it's not displaying uh, any black questions. So definitely throw it over into there um, if you would want to do so. Finally, the perpetual revenue, Dante, this is why I love the cloud model for our yeah. customers, is the fact, and especially here at Ring Central, um, is the fact that they don't stop getting paid if they are still a customer of Ring Central, yeah. they constantly will get that check and get payment on that. And so, what are some of the advantages, what's some of the cool stuff on this perpetual revenue um, idea? So, the first thing is first, right? It starts with the discovery. We're going to work on that together with a subject matter expert. We're going to make sure we find the proper solution. We're going to make sure that we do matching of feature sets to what they want. And that way, the, the customer stays, right? They're happy. With our pro service and our implementation team, that's where we get into the designing and the deployment of this. You're going to leverage those tools as a partner to make sure that this is going to market appropriately. And once again, they're going to be retained as a customer and then the go live portion of it too. Right? So perpetually, your revenue is going to get more and more by selling Ring Central. You're going to be able to stack services by selling complementary products right through our APIs. You're going to be able to leverage our professional services environment. You're also going to be able to leverage our signature program as well to upsell on top of your customers, to be able to maximize revenues and uncover hidden hidden sales that you maybe now even thought about as a partner, right? 
And this is why I like talking about the importance of that implementation. As you guys all, all, all know, the first impression with the new technology inside a, a company is critical. And we've got a great implementation team with a very developed strategy to make sure that is a successful experience and a great experience for your customer. All right, and so we've got a process in place. What's why I love it, talking implementation when it comes to perpetual revenue, because as everyone else, we've got a 30-day out. If they if the implementation goes poorly, they might be able to do debook, right? Well, that's a terrible position for you to be in and for us. But because of our implementation team, we've got a crazy over 99% with our partners, uh, uh, renewal rates. Those are the things that all add up for you to continue to get paid month over month year after year as long as they're a ring central partner and that kind of dives into our final program we really want to talk about you know we don't leave the sales once they've sold it once you know we've sold the deal and it's in we don't just move on from it as a company ring central continues to work with you to provide your customer with all the attention and information that they need to maximize their current investment so they don't look at it after a year going you know what do we really Utilize all the stuff that Ring Central has. Yes, no, I don't know. You know, that's when you start getting into really have to fight to get them to stay with Ring Central. With our signature program, they're constantly getting attention. They're constantly being updated and all the cool features. And guess what? We're going to help you upsell them too, like Dante had said earlier regarding hey, if they're already a customer of yours, they don't have contact center yet, hey, the signature team can help you sell that. And again, that's other sales resources that you don't have to pay for. You don't have to commission, you don't have to benefit, none of that. We do that for you and you still get 100% of everything. I can't tell you how many partners we've helped to grow their accounts across the nation because they didn't want to go travel, they didn't want to spend all their time in different regions that they're not in. Right? We can do that all for you and you'll still get 100% commission of every single thing our channel signature team does. And I think the other best part about our channel signature is all they do is work with channel. All right, so every channel deal gets sold by our channel signature on the back end as well for anything that's new, and they work with channel all day long. Again, we want you to make sure that when you partner with Ring Central, the people you talk to understand your business, understand how to work with channel so it can be as successful as possible. We dedicate headcount who just work with channel. Anything else you want to say on the signature program? I think you, I mean, you hit the nail on the head, right? Now you have an account manager that's going to grow that account for you, that's going to make sure that they're utilizing the technology as best as possible. And that's why, you know, as, a, as an organization, Ring Central has a 98.7 retention rate, but partner deals end up being around 99%. Yeah. And it's because we have that one two punch. You, as a consummate professional and a trusted resource, for your customers out there, and then Ring Central really bringing the value of continually checking in with that customer and making sure that they're getting the most out of their investment and maybe uncovering those details that, uh, that no one really thought about. Yeah. So, on that, any questions from the field? That's kind of all that we had uh, kind of prepared for you guys to get done in an hour. Any questions from the field itself that might you guys have always wanted to ask? And just a reminder to this is going to be available on CNSG's portal. So you'll be able to recap and go back to this. Uh, you can reach out to me, Dante.white at ringcentral.com if you have questions. If you'd like to see the platform itself, we can schedule a follow up to this to show you a, an engineering, a user interface portion of this. But I wanted to make sure everybody understood what the program looked like and what the product looked like as an overhead. And then also remind you go to glip.com and download the free app. Reach out to me, you'll be able to find me on Glip and uh, become part of the uh, Dante's Information Download group where I'll be putting content out there for people to check in on. You'll be able to find this here or there as well. So if there are no questions, looks like you don't have any questions. Not at the moment. We are good, man. We are good at day or something. All right, again, if, if you are asking questions, put it into the chat box. And so we could kind of kind of see that just to make sure. And uh, thank you all for attending. Um, if we didn't answer your question, definitely email Dante White, 
and uh, so we make sure that you do get that question answered. Um, so thank you all for attending on the phone. Thank you, Clay and James and Jeffrey, for attending um, via the actual webinar and the computer interface itself. Thanks, everyone, and have a great selling day. Thanks.